Thank good to you. see you. Good to see Definitely. you too. Definitely. One of the things that we've been very concerned about is is that digital divide in San Antonio. Yes. And you know from um, the the map released by HUD mm -hmm. during the Connect Home. That line is very stark, right across the middle of San Antonio, and it's an economic divide as well as a, as well as a digital divide. Um, Connect Home is going to provide free internet broadband access to people at home. About 6,000 families in San Antonio who are in um, public housing, and those families it's not a question of affordable, nothing's affordable to them, yes. because it's a choice between yes. paying for food and yes. paying for internet access, yes. so that's a big deal. But that's 6,000 families, and this is a yes. city of you know, more than a million, yes. and with th that stark, stark divide on the south side and the east side of San Antonio, where people, it's not a question of getting faster internet, it's a question of getting internet at all at home. What do you think this is going to do, and how much did that come up in the conversations with Google? Well, I think um, certainly we're on the right path as far as uh, trying to make access uh, more readily available to uh, residents that you know don't have the financial means to to connect in these ways. So, Connect Home certainly is a great start. The, the fiber infrastructure allows us to um, think about how we can use that to either start off by having it available in our pub some of our public facilities like libraries and community centers and then also start figuring out how we can make it more readily accessible for everyone to have it in their home. So, um, I think that's definitely been part of the conversation uh, with the person that they have that's been focused here in the community on, you know, kind of getting the word out and helping even small business owners to understand uh, how how they can utilize uh, the city. Okay, all right. Thank so we're you moving in the right direction. Okay. Um, like, yeah, you're right. Six thousand put a drop in the bucket, but. It is a start. Well, and, and I was very impressed by the, the new superintendent of SAISD oh, yeah. who talked about the difference it makes to have that at home. Yes. Because I know many of the San Antonio campuses, the school district campuses, are very fast. We've streamed from there, and I know mm -hmm. how fast they are. Mm -hmm. But when, when they go from even um, Wheatley, mm -hmm. when they go across the street from Wheatley, mm -hmm. there is no internet access. And, and so they can't do their homework online. They can't see yes. the, you know, they can't access um, video, you know, okay. to see yes. the seven yes. wonders of the world right. Right. and to see outside of their neighborhood in San Antonio. So, I mean, that's the difference he's talked about, you know, high-speed broadband making for those kids. Well, maybe we need to have more community conversations about it and so we can start building a plan. Yeah. Yeah. I think we can. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Good to see Very you. Much. Good, Good to see you. you. Okay. Take care. All right. Fiber isn't in a lot of cities right now, is it? And what made San Antonio?